What's up gamers, Six Pity here and I'm back with another PGA Tour 2K21 course showcase video coming at you with a brand new course today, Jetta Dunes Part 3 course by Drummonds, also known as Daniel, one of my favorite designers in the game. Everything that Daniel designs is just awesome from the environment, the way the course plays, and the incredible clubhouses, cityscape, and just and this one has an awesome practice facility. This also has a practice course, the Jitta Practice Facility. And so just type in Jitta Practice and you can actually practice. It's really cool. Uh, so big shout out to Daniel. Thank you for the hard work on this. To all you other designers out there as well, you all are all legends. Thank you for the hard work. I'm gonna be diving into on the default settings here. So it's gonna be default wind speed direction, default fairways and green is going to be firm firm then medium fast green speeds and we're going to try to get a hole in one i've been close on daniel's courses before but is today the day i finally get a hole in one in a course showcase video if you get some enjoyment drop a like i'd appreciate it and subscribe for more content every single day on the gamer Booty youtube channel and be sure you click that notification bell and turn on all notifications and i will say this course course does get the squirrel stamp of approval and that's actually we're gonna do our flyover fly up and show, first i just want you to see this beautiful plot of land like just look at this so that right there you see in the middle of the screen that's the practice facility and you can actually play the full practice course by uh, searching it just like i said earlier so there is the plot of land there's a racetrack out there there's a practice facility and a full part three course and a full city imagine playing golf here this looks amazing and i will show you probably this is goes down as one of the best squirrel placements i've ever seen now look at this practice facility first not only is it beautiful wait till you see what's on the practice screen the gift that daniel gave us look at the squirrel right on imagine you're just sitting there practice putting and you put your ball and you don't have to pick it up the squirrel go goes grabs it for you and brings it back to you i mean what a what a practice screen here <laughs> and really what a practice ability but great job putting the squirrel there and great placement there but just i mean everything is beautiful the practice facility we have the lighthouse here on the left side the course itself i mean this course is fantastic it, it blew me away daniel always blows me away at this courses but let's go ahead and get on with it and get a hole in one here we go. I'm going to I'm going to hit the 233 should be a really good club. No, I'm going to go 215. 215 a little bit overpowered. Just a beautiful beautiful lighting, the aesthetics of the course, the fill, the planting, the elevation changes. Honestly, it's just all perfect and I'm amazed. Oh, be the one. That's not a bad start. <laughs> That is not a bad start at all. We'll yeah, take nice it. Work. That is a, that's a good little approach shot. We'll take our birdie. And as always, right, gamers, well get out there and play this course. Let me know what you shoot down in the comment below. I like to keep track of who wins. Nobody yeah, has beat me on the last course showcases. Somebody's going to finally beat me? Or maybe somebody beats me and you all just don't want to post a comment about beating like me. <laughs> maybe that's what it is. It's like, uh, we don't want to make Gamer feel bad, but I beat him by five strokes. <laughs> oh, way too short. That is unfortunate. Got a lucky okay, bounce that. up that hill. We there got we the go. course designer roll. Let's see if we can send this one in. Couple birdies. Oh. I wonder what the course record is. I wonder what Daniel shot. All right, we'll take our par. You know, you want to birdie every hole, but we're going for aces, right? We're going for aces. I love par three battle. courses so much. Careful just look at this hole. You can see part right of the practice facility to the left, the lighthouse in the background. This would be a great hole to ace. But I think we could say that about all of them, right? Oh, be the one. Come on. Does it have enough on it? I knew it was slightly downhill. Oh, look at this. That's a big golf shot. It's not going to be the ace we wanted, but it's going to be a tap-in birdie, basically. Really well-judged approach there. 
Oh, okay, that uh, it showed that it was breaking right at the beginning and then flat. It was actually looked like it was breaking right and then left. Alrighty, down to two under power. Little trickery. Look at that city in the background. This one up on that is the floor. sweet. That expect. I love how these buildings are connected there. That is cool. And we see part of the racetrack in the background as well. Let's see, it's going to be a 188. Or no. Yeah, I'm going to go 188 overpowered. A little bit of front spin. That swing was to die for. A little bit overpowered. John says the swing was to die for. That sh means it should be a hole in one, right? Oh, uh, John's not right. Even though it was technically a perfect tempo and perfect power so we can't really complain here's our second shot very chip in I'm, I'm going right for it with the sand wedge well maybe we shouldn't have maybe we shouldn't okay, have that was not the greatest the decision this putt's good so far okay it was basically flat nice putt that's in there for par just i mean this course is awesome i know i talk right, about all the time my course showcases how beautiful the these courses are but isn't this just a work of art and when you saw it from above at the beginning in the intro and also when I did the flyover, it did not look like a work of art. What is this? You all, you Great designers are just insane at the game. That's too, uh, it's too much. Yeah, I was trying to partial, but just put too much smack on it. The hole in one is looking a long nice way off. I'm not going to lie. We have some and work to do in order a... to get... A Very hole in one. To contend this with. design community is so good. So good. Look at you all just keep giving us content. And there's going to be a lot of par three courses coming your all's way from Victory Lane's no, par three competition. So you'll this be stay great. tuned. I'm gonna sure. I'm gonna try to showcase three as many five. as I can, and maybe even That'll do some good. live streams showcasing them as well. All right, still. Two but par three courses are my favorite courses. Oh, look at okay, this gift. I <laughs> feel like Daniel put this hole just in here for us. You can see the Praxfilly City in the background. Wow, I want to play this course in real life. Let's ace it. Does it have enough? Can we get a kick left? Not enough. Well, maybe this hole wasn't a that. gift. <laughs> <laughs> Sink this and you'll pull down a birdie. Maybe it wasn't a gift. No, I really wanted that there, one bad. Did yeah, didn't quite get there, John. Yeah, I need some coffee. What, what is what is happening with our golf game right now? And currently sitting I, I thrive on coffee. Teeing off on this one. Okay, here we go. Uh, I'm gonna go 170, a slide overpowered, and full send this one. Oh, full send it a fast, though. I still think it's going to be just fine. It's going to be just fine, but it's not going to be the hole-in-one we wanted. But there's plenty of golf left. There's no need to worry. A hole-in-one will come in time. Safe shot. All right, 20 feet to go. Beautiful cityscape in the background. Just beautiful uh, right this course is a max star rating i mean you talk about the five out of five so far so good which is the base score it has a squirrel oh, so it moves it to that 15 20 out of 10 and but it's also beautiful and perfect so i think this is round. another unlimited star course now we're infinite star review like this is just fantastic you see the lighthouse good view of the lighthouse in the background i needed backspin right come on Come on! Holy no! <laughs> and the tee shot going off the pin. Okay, How I retire. <laughs> it's, uh, you know, hole number eight on Daniel's new course finally drew me into retirement. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Says. Just got robbed by the pin. Why wow, that Three one? You know that one hurts. Okay, I'm not retiring. Okay, I'm coming out of retirement. I'm back. Right to left but wow, we almost had it. I, I'm serious, gamers. My chair was pulled back. My arms were in the air. I was about ready to leap up 20 feet up in the air and run around the house if we hit that ace. Is that a little bit of over exaggeration? Probably. <laughs> but who cares? It's an ace. <laughs> Oh, that hurts so bad. Daniel, if you come across this video, 
Wow, am I crushed by what your pin design did to me there. You should have put different pins in there. You know, more forgiving pins in a par 3 course? A wayward on the approach. <laughs> Always right, blame though. the pins, right? Oh my, that one hurt so bad. I thought we had it. What Good a golf shot, though. That's not... Well that's 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 still... It was still an amazing golf hot. shot. That's not... Oh, look, gamer's about to throw his club. Did you see that? Too hard. Why did we come out of retirement to get Good. a bogey? You hate there to see go. it. There's the bogey. Hole number eight almost broke Ryan Gamer. And after that hole, <laughs> you'll go up to two under. Let's see. One set. Yeah, it's 185 on uphill one foot. Look at this hole. And let's look at the clubhouse here so you can see it. There's a rock trail leading up to it. Just so pretty. Oh, be the one. I mean, these holes are perfect. These holes are perfect. Like, they're aceable. They're also a little bit challenging. There's a good mixture of easy, tough ones. Might be might be one of the best par 3 courses that I've played. It's up there. It's up there as one of my favorite par 3 courses. And give this one a tap, and we will mosey on our way. We have eight holes left. I still think, I still have to say, okay, my favorite so part three course in the game is still the part three course on the channel created by CWL Racing. On it's on a zoo. It. It's just, it fits that. It's just like, for me, it's, it, there's so many aceable holes. It's just a fun course. I love that hole. So that's still my number one, but this, this might be up there with it. Nice. Tied. Or a little bit, I, I don't think I can pick a winner. You're all winners, but wow, is this up there. This is up there with CWO Gamers Part 3. And then the it's, it's just it's just amazing what you all can create. The Bull Kraken is another one of my favorite Part 3 courses. And then um, the Chameleon Club is another one of my favorites. Let's go. I feel, you know, I do feel like Daniel's going to be a little disappointed in what we're scoring right now. But I think Daniel's going to be happy that we almost had an ace. Or maybe discouraged that we missed the ace. <laughs> who thought, who else, let me know in a comment, who else was about to leap out of your chair? No way I was the only one. No way. And if nobody else comments... Saying they were gonna they were gonna leap out of the chair. I don't know if I believe you all. Cause we almost had it. <laughs> that was a pretty good shot. That is not an easy hole, but I was distracted by the pretty background. Look at that. Twenty-two feet to the cup. Get in. Super. Get in. Oh. oh man. I All thought right, that was going to be the one. That's okay. Out. We'll take a par. We're not going to complain. You know, it's about showcasing these here. awesome courses, not about scoring exceptionally well. So that makes you. All, but all is fine if we hit an ace. So let's see if we can map this out. out. Right I'm going to go a partial 142, land it right here. And these default wins are not the easiest. I feel like I short swinged it. So I did. I, I short swinged it a touch. Well, that short swing was actually perfect club from where we hit. Should be a tap in birdie. Right, little sailboat in the birdie. background. This course Good is work. just fantastic. Okay. I mean, let's have a, let's have another one. this. <laughs> I'm gonna be coming back to this one multiple okay, times, and I'm gonna try to get redemption on hole number eight. Teeing off now. Two thirty-three. See, my three. least favorite par threes are these long par threes, but I mean, you have to have them, right? In a part three course, you need a good variety. Watch that would have been the one we ace, right? When I when I talk about how I don't really like these type of holes, <laughs> we ace it. Oh my! Nothing wrong with that. But we did not, so all, all is fine. Twenty feet to the cup. Short swing. What? Where are these short swings coming from? I've been doing that a lot lately. I'm an anxious uh, golfer. I just want to swing the club. <laughs> I just want to swing it. Come on, just swing it forward. <laughs> okay, four holes left. Plenty of golf left to get an ace. Look at the eight. It looks like an H in the background. It looks like an H there. In the city. 
I'm going to go 161 with a little bit of D-loft. Slowed it. That felt so slow. Going right. I haven't hit a slow like that in a long time. We're going to be splashing from the heavy stuff. That approach, but that's okay. But this round, if may be saved by an ace. You know, I want to say it was saved by that near ace, okay, but I don't think that counts. <laughs> I really don't. I, I just and don't think that gets it going for me. I feel like we need an ace to save this round. For Daniel. Might need a bit more I'm going to go 161. On full send. Let's see, which way is it going to break? To the left. This is it. I sit up real straight on that one. Tried to really get into the shot. Getting, uh, a little bit to the left. And it, all that for that, right? All that pre-shot work to just end up 20 feet away from the hole. That'll do for the approach. And here we go. Potential. Let's see if we can send this birdie home, though. It's a, you know, I'm not playing oh, it like it's a really scorable tough. course. You all are going to beat me. Somebody's right, going to beat me this week. Corner. I just know it. Somebody's beating yeah, me in this course showcase. I'm just going to have to take the loss this one. Okay, after Good that, job, we'll gamers. I already give you the congratulation the for beating me this week. Here we go. Let's stick this one nice and close. You know, this is my, again, my, th I, these are my least favorite type of par threes. There's, there's two of them. Th three, this one that you can't even get to, right? But I understand why you have them. I'm not upset for having them on the course because I think they're needed. But I'm glad it's there's only three of them. Well, it wasn't your best swing. And I'm sure there's a lot of you all that like those type of par threes, right? Those long par threes. That's you're like, yeah, you have to have a lot of finesse. They're fun. And this is our second I just don't see them that the way. I don't know what it is about them. I think it's because I'm not good at them. <laughs> To be honest with you, I think it's that I'm just not good at them. Let's. That's not a good reason, is it? Here we go. We have one hole left. One more chance for an ace. We got robbed on eight. We got robbed on eight. We're going to have to parcel this one into the hole. This is for you, gamers. All my believers out there. One time this ace. Come on, get down on that green. Get down on it. Come on. <laughs> I thought it was close. It was close. It was close. Oh, I thought it was going to be dangerously work. close. It ended up a little further than I expected, but just a fantastic course. Incredible work. Infinity stars. This thing's a thing of beauty. The golf is awesome. The landscaping is amazing. Just the whole plot of land is just perfection. Thank you so much for your hard work. You know, we did not get the ace. We did get robbed, though. We got absolutely robbed. And we'll remember that. We'll be coming back for redemption on a live stream of this. We'll be coming back to this course on the next live stream. But gamers, thank you for watching this video to the end. And Daniel, thank you for your hard work. Incredible. Appreciate everything you and all you other designers out there. All that you do for this community is much appreciated. You all are all legends. Thank you for the hard work. Drop a like if you got some enjoyment. And subscribe if you have not done so already for more content every single day on the Gamer Booty YouTube channel. And click that notification bell and be a part of the notification squad today. I will see you all in the next video. You can check out all my course showcases by checking the playlist in the description or just checking the channel page every single day. My TDC Tours content is on the channel as well. As always, gamers, have a fantastic day.